my dudes. Today, Huck texted me again with some weird plans and was like, I've got a Lotus for the day. Why don't you grab the Cooper and we'll go for a rag? So, I can't really say no to that. So that's what we're doing. I think he's got an Exceed or something like that. We're gonna take some photos, we're gonna do some videos. Other than that, I don't really know what we're doing today. So, your guess is just as good as mine. Let's go get to Huck's. Let's go find this Lotus and we'll go for some ragging. moved house since the uh, the Huckleberry Mountain house check so this is our new house which is equally just in in the middle of nowhere Hello. look how many cobwebs my car has we need to do an updated garage check with you yeah it's just the two vehicles at the moment what's your dog's name again Mercy Mercy that's it she comes here every morning to sunbathe but Bless her, it's not warm enough, is it? No, that's why she's got a little blanket in it. There you go, you have that. <laughs> Last question. Yeah. You still have uh, those gollywogs. Okay, for, for clarity, I don't live here, right? <laughs> my mum who lives here. I just happen to keep my bikes here. Turn a little bit to the right. <laughs> <laughs> if you, uh, if you haven't seen Huck's old house check, I'll put it up in one of the cards over here. Go watch that, because you see all his guns and gollywogs. No, they're not mine. <laughs> Huck's mum's mum. Oh my god, there's a big one there. <laughs> <laughs> ah, good times, alright mate? How you doing? <sighs> What's the plan? Huck again has told me fuck all. All I know is a Lotus, that's all I know. We are gonna go and see British sports car dealer yep. up the road. And they've got loads of Lotuses and Caterhams and I really want to drive one. So what have we got? A Lotus Exige. We've got a Lotus X Siege 410, 0 to 60 in 3.3 seconds. It's going to be like one of the best driving cars, like, released this year. Sick. And then a Caterham 310. Mate, you can't see anything in this. No, it's like, the field of view is pretty limited. It's like being inside a post box. <laughs> Huck hasn't been in this car for three years, four years, I think? Yeah. So, it's definitely changed a lot. You gotta play the game, how many grunts you do getting out of the car. <coughs> right, look what we have here. That's so sick. We're here. Uh, this is, what's it called? Williams? Oh, there's an exige. Sorry, uh, Williams Automobiles. Williams Automobiles. We're in the middle of the countryside and they've just got loads of, what, sports cars? Loads of British sports cars. I'm so excited. I've wanted to drive a Lotus for like ages. It's a cool little spot. So we're going out in this. So what is this again, sorry? Uh, it's Caterham 310 S, SV, so it's a wider body. Even and though the wider body doesn't make any difference for you, uh, <laughs> <laughs> And the 310 is the brake per weight ratio, right? Yeah, correct. So it's three. Yeah, so it's around sort of 150 horsepower. I love that little steering wheel. And so indicators are on this switch here. Yeah. Obviously left and right. Heater if you need it, if you get cold. This one, it's all quite self-explanatory. Five-speed manual. If you turn the key, it goes around twice. That's it, fuel pump's on. And then to start it, it's on the red button. Hold it. <laughs> oh yeah. This is gonna be sick. And also, pretty cold. It's quite nippy today, and we got no doors or roof, but I don't care because we're in a catering room, it looks cool. And 300 brake per ton, for reference, the Cupra is 200 brake per ton. How'd you get in this? Oh. You yeah. fucked it already. Oh no. Get your other leg in. I already know I can't do that. 
there you go. <laughs> oh my god, you're so limber. Let's go. <laughs> the plan is we're going to drive this for a bit, and then this afternoon we're going to come back and grab that low at Siege. We're going to switch to GoPros. Now. Okay then. Okay. All right. change is tiny. The steering wheel is the same size as my hand. <laughs> um, if I was Shaquille O'Neal. Oh god, I've got to be quiet for the horse. Sorry, horse. She was fair. She was well fair. I hope she thinks this is my car. Well, this is the A46, which is where we want to go, isn't it? On the throttle. Yeah, I know. It's <laughs> All right, so we're gonna do a 0 to 60. I've got the older climber do up here. Stop, reset. Right, tell me when you're ready. But it's around the corner. It'd be right. Yeah, I'm ready. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> Will do fantastic, won't it? <laughs> now get up. Got to use the, I don't want to stand <laughs> on the seat. It reminds me of um, Wolf of Wall Street. Ready, man. <laughs> Put both legs in first. I oh, know, I just didn't know how to start that, really. <laughs> yeah. Fuck you. Ooh. Reversed. Oh my god, that is a short throw. For a start, that's the smallest steering wheel I've ever touched in my life. And there <laughs> you are, the smallest. Mate, you look so squashed. Exhilarating. I enjoyed that. It's fucking Imagine cold. what one with double the power, that's 620. Yeah, that'd be horrible. It already feels quite like loose, doesn't it? Yeah. Like you take one hand off the steering wheel and it just goes like <laughs> Hux hiding in the woods somewhere taking photos. We're on blind corner in a 60 zone. This is very dangerous, but worth it. Nice. Right, Huck's taken over again. We've got some cool photos. And we're gonna go head back to Williams and uh, and get the um, the other one. You just... Uh... <laughs> Direct me back to where we're going. Yeah. All right. 
Well, that was an experience. And now we've been handed the keys <laughs> to this, which is just going to be nuts. AP brakes, Pirate Sport Cup two tyres. Mate, look at that gear lever. That gear lever's incredible. Um, what are the specs on this? Can we Google it, or do you know? 410 horsepower V6, supercharged, 0 to 60, 3.3, 80 grand. Really expensive for a low risk Let's go. This is a moment for me. You ever seen a grown man cry? Feels like a golf. <laughs> yeah, it's cold. And the clutch is pretty stiff. <laughs> this is bonkers. Shit, that sounds good. It's definitely way louder outside than it is inside. <laughs> All right, let's not get killed crossing the road. Okay, pick me up, please. Thank you, I'm cold. I've worked out why it's limmy bashing. Why? So I put it in sport mode now. Oh, it wasn't in sport mode? No, so it was revving to like five and a half. Yeah. One and a half under and then was redlining, so that's why every gear change is like, what the bam bam? for me. Oh, there you go, mate. Nice. We've uh, just released these new ones, so uh, plug. The steering's pretty heavy, isn't it? Yeah. The clutch is real stiff, yeah. yeah.
Yeah. yeah. You're not looking at the rev when you're driving, but you can hear and you can feel and you're like, okay, I've got another thousand. But yeah, and then it just cuts. Put it in sport. Yeah, it won't. Yeah. Stress ball. Nice. Right. Should go a little bit further. Done. Shout out to uh, Williams. That was fun. Ow. <laughs> yeah, back in the post box. Cheers for that. Well, always, man. I had a good time. That was fun. Super fun. I think I prefer driving the Caterham. Lucky then. Yeah, because you prefer the other one, didn't you? <laughs> there you go. You um, actually prefer the Caterham over the Lotus? I prefer driving it, yeah. Well, because it feels like an experience as opposed to... Um... And I felt like I could give it more shit. Just because the... Well, you're doing 120 miles an hour in third gear in the Lotus. No. But I reckon you potentially could do, you know yeah. what I mean? I reckon, yeah, if you if you floored it, I think you could get quite fast. Yeah. No, I... Actually, no, I kind of siding with you. I did... The catering was cool. Yeah. But I'd own the Lotus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've got two bikes. Ruby. Blue the engine. Is this Ruby? And, uh, this is Ruby. Look at that pile of... Oh <laughs> yeah! So basically, I blew the engine at Mali Mile racing it. But yeah, and then since then, I bought Lindsay. Lindsay. Yeah, Lindsay Lohan. Because I bought her on Friday the thirteenth, and she's a skinny redhead with a drinking problem. I said to myself, like, when I get my first big paycheck, I want to get a Harley. So I did. It does work. I just, I just trickle charge it, so the battery doesn't die. The handlebars are literally the weirdest thing about this bike. You get so many comments on the handlebars, but I like it. It might start. It's real cold. But yeah, I guess you could say this is my daily. <laughs> Come on. Come on. That means it will start. Nice. Better fucking start. <laughs> I don't think you connected it properly. We're fucking filming. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, hold on, here we go. That's good. You fucking work. You little bitch. Maybe it's because the headlight's too bright. You know? Yeah, that's probably it. Try it again. I told you she works. <laughs> <laughs> it was the headlight after all. Yeah. Where's your wallet then? Where's your cards? Where are my cards? Yeah. I've never owned a wallet. Have you got cards on you? Alright, come here. I'll sort you out. I'll sort you out there, boy. We've just released these. These are the new uh, pouch wallets. I'm kind of going for the green because you don't really see card Sorry. holders in that green. Hmm. I've got the green. I'm going to go for green because yeah. it matches my colour palette. For your eyes. <laughs> yeah, man. Can I have the green? Yeah, definitely. Pop your cards in and see what. Take it for a spin. Can't wait. And it comes free with a bit of foam. Yeah. I put like two in each side and then there's three in the middle. You can fit up to 10 cards. You don't look like a 10 card kind of man. You look like a two card kind of man. I'm a two card guy. It's on my tin. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Where should I buy this? Bark123.com. Heard of it. Link in the description. There you go. Should we give one away as well? Yeah. We've got a green, we got the brown and the black. So whoever wants to win one of these, you can choose whatever color you want. If you have a big wallet and you swap to one of these small ones, you will never go back to a big one. I used to have a big one and you just don't need it. Basically, all you gotta do is leave a comment in this video down below and we'll pick you to win one of those wallets or go to the website and buy one. Does that, okay, what does that have to be a comment about? Ask us any question you want in the YouTube section down below. But the most creative and actual genuinely good question. Yeah, comment if you want more videos with Huck and doing more stupid stuff with stupid cars. I've got more silly stuff like that. What do you want to see next? Yeah, comment who you think would win in a fight between Clem and Chris Jones. Oh, it'd be quite good because yeah. Chris works out quite a lot. Chris is quite like, Chris has actually got quite a, lot, a bit of butchness under there, but then Clem's also bigger. Clem's been to uni though. That's true, you get hard at uni. <laughs> Trust me, I know. Oh, the other thing as well. We've just... <laughs> Can you put that up somewhere? Does it smell like the other one? No, that one smells like vanilla. It smells like cat, cat litter. <laughs> so 
So yeah, I made Vossi Air Fresheners. Find me. Haven't you got another cat now? Yeah, Maggie. So we got the, the black, which you've already seen. We've got the white, which is mint flavor. And these ones, which are camo, and these are vanilla or strawberry. Can't remember which one. Uh, open it and smell. Okay, so then this one's vanilla, then the other one is strawberries. So. Yeah. Yeah, it smells like yop. So we're also gonna give away a bunch of these to another person. So two people can win on this video. So all you gotta do, drop a comment. We have just released those four. So go on the website, have a look. You can buy all of them for eight quid. <laughs> I don't know why I'm looking at you to follow that up. Not buying them. I'll try, I'll I'll uh, I'll put all four in your bedroom to cover up the smell of your mum's weed. No, I'm joking. <laughs> oh, I just panicked. I was like, where's my card? <laughs> oh, here it is. Oh, shit. Point up in the air. You win last week's video. Thank well you. Well done. <laughs> Not you. <All> right. <laughs> so you win whatever I, uh, whatever I gave away last week, which I can't remember. So congratulations. I'll send that to you. Thanks for the fun day. No worries. I had a fun time. It's been a blast. Yeah. I will see you guys next week. Thanks for watching. Enjoy your dinner. Goodbye. <laughs>